What is up guys? Welcome to another video. If you're a new subscriber to my channel, welcome. Hope you enjoy the content. Uh, feel free to let me know if there's anything that you want to see. If you're an existing uh, subscriber, thank you for coming back. I always uh, appreciate your support guys. So, three weeks post holiday. I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, videos that uh, I've been putting up of our travels. Um, if you haven't seen them, please check them out. Um, yeah, it was a bit of fun doing those things, so um, definitely enjoyed it. It's my first video post holiday, so I'm still putting up content for you guys. So, like I said, I hope you're enjoying it. I, I thought I'd uh, film a bit of a vlog day today. Today's agenda: I've got to go pick up a new iPhone 8, so I'm excited to uh, show you guys what that is all about, give you my little view on it. Um, I've got to get a workout in and uh, the usual. So come along and uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. First things first this morning is uh, you probably would have guessed it if you've seen my channel before, coffee. So, we're back to normality after our holidays. We ran out of these puppies, but we're back. So 45 grams of protein, low in carb, moderate fat. Two almond milk lattes, we'll get this down, and then I'll head over and see if I can get my hands on uh, one of these Apple iPhones. Coffee down, now we function. There she is. First time you've seen her. It's been, so happy. it's been a while. So still uh, got the holiday blues, me more than uh, Rach, but what can we do? We have planned another trip, so we will take you guys along as always. I'm going uh, to head over, get my hands on one of these iPhone 8s, and uh, I will show you guys what it looks like. I just picked up the new phone. I will uh, give you guys a look on package the stuff uh, if you haven't seen it before. But first things first, I drop Rach off at work. I'll go hit a session up. So I'm thinking about doing a little bit of shoulders and some arms. But you guys will check it out. I'll put some clips in there. This is a Mr. Tracky production.
done and dusted so a bit of a change in scenery trained at the advertiser where uh, we run our group corporate sessions like I said somewhere different a little bit of a different atmosphere plus I uh, had my good man Kev do some filming so that was handy definitely got a got a bit of a pump going which was good so we're gonna take advantage of uh, this good day here and have a go and spend a little bit of time at the beach before we have to go back to work. So I'll take you guys down there, show you what's around, show you where we live. Close to where we live. Anyway, I'll see you there soon. So, just made it to the beach. Surprise, surprise, the sun's gone, but uh, that's always my luck. Anyway, I've got the crew with me, they're just uh, ahead. We've got Rach and Big Joe. minutes in to our little stroll we thought we'd uh, stop for a bit of a pit stop I got the crew with me I got Big Joe and I got Rach uh, keeping up with a cheesecake just enjoying a little bit of uh, of this lovely breeze coming through it's shit the weather's gone it always happens coffee cake done and dusted so the trek home which is about two and a half k's so nothing too much Oh, the sun's coming out. Look out. The sun's oh, peeping through, that? so hopefully we uh, might get a little bit of colour on the way back. Right, so, just got home from our walk. So, probably about uh, 45, 50 minutes in total. 
we just went out to uh, try and get a bit of sun and uh, just our luck, sun goes away as soon as we get there. But it's always nice to have a walk, find it nice and calming down the beach anyway. So plenty of people down there. Anyway, what I've been waiting for, the new iPhone. So reason being that I'm upgrading to an iPhone 8 is because this one is about 18 months old and uh, it's starting to go on me. So I had the uh, iPhone 6S rose gold. The biggest problem I found with this is the battery uh, and not just the battery, the camera. Check this out. Yeah, so the camera was shaking, it's spasming all over the place, and uh, that's when you know it's time for an upgrade. Anyway, so went out today, got myself the iPhone 8. Uh, I think this is the 64, 64 gigabytes. So plenty of space on there, enough for me. So let's check it out. There it is. Oh. So phones out, I've got the jet black this time, so changing it up. It's quite a nice jet black. Headphones, adapter. Uh, also my provider threw in another set of headphones in there, so these are the wireless. I think they were about $130, but um, yeah, got them thrown in, maybe because I spent so much money with with my provider and I've got this wallet case holder. Not a big fan of case holders because the phone's big enough, but the wife has one of these and I found them quite handy and uh, I dropped my phone a lot, so hopefully this might protect it a bit, but it doubles back as a wallet as well, so yeah, quite handy little uh, device there. Anyway. Let's check this out. Phone on. So finally, iPhone is set up. I don't mind it. The only thing is that sort of got me a little bit is that I needed to download a heap of different things to upgrade iTunes, everything like that. So it took me quite a while to get this going, but it's up and running. And uh, I don't like how it's a six figure passcode. Anyway, small problems. Other than that, so far so good. The cameras, oh, anything would have been better than what I had. So, nice and easy to operate. It's got some new features, um, folders, clips, so things like that. So, so far so good. I'm impressed with it at the moment. Um, hopefully I keep this one off the floor and I keep the dumbbells off it because that's what happened to the last one before I had to get it fixed. Yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed that little viewing of the uh, iPhone 8. Yeah, there will be plenty more selfies to come. Alrighty, so getting a quick meal in before work. Nothing too uh, exciting, but I'll just show you guys you know, having a couple of uh, kangaroo and cheese and lettuce toasties with a side of veggies. been on this toasty kick ever since we got back and I can't stop having them so at least two a day sometimes four why because macros I'm gonna get this down and then we'll head back to work so I'll catch you guys a little bit later on so heading back to work that's the life of a PT those split shifts so we'll see you guys there
And that's it. This is the best time of the day when the gym's empty and it's time to go home. So, finished up our classes, PT stuff. Um, like I said, we'll head home. Bit of dinner and uh, probably do a little bit of work on the computer, a little bit of programming. I'll edit some videos. I'll show you guys what we have for dinner, um, see what we can come up with. Probably be another toasty because like I said to you guys, I'm uh, a bit obsessed over that at the moment. So, but you never know, I might change my mind on the way home. So stay tuned. Alrighty, so finally sitting down to dinner. What time is it? It is 9.27 p.m. So I'll show you what I've got. The usual salad. You might have seen this before on my channel. I've got some uh, spud light potatoes, some kanga bangers, and a homemade burger. Kangaroo burger. So check it out. I've got myself uh, one Pepsi Max. There's the salad. Rach, what do you got? Those greens, potatoes, and roux sausages. So we'll get this stuff down. We'll probably have a little bit more macros to hit uh, at the end of the night, but I'll show you guys what we uh, finished the night off. So feeling kind of hungry. Had a shower, getting ready for bed, and uh, just finishing the macros off. So what I've got here is 120 mils of vanilla ice cream and I've got a rice crispy bar that homemade rice crispy protein and some peanut butter so one of those bars is 20 carbs four fat and uh, 11 protein so I'm gonna get this down I've got a little bit more to hit but I'll show you guys what uh what we come up with final meal of the night so right here I've got one serve of the Carmen's um, oats with chia seeds and coconut. I've got six rice cakes with some peanut butter and some reduced sugar free jam and one homemade on a bread pancake with a little bit of uh, peanut butter on there. So today's macros were 220 grams of protein 276 grams of carbs and 70 grams of fat so still uh, doing a little bit of reverse diet uh, after the mini cut um, but I feel like I've got plenty of food to eat for the time being so I'm gonna end the video there guys hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe and uh, be sure to follow me on my social media links. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.